Good morning, Cold Spring Harbor. I'm Dean Park Ford. And I'm John McGowan. Today is Tuesday, October 6th, and it is day four. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Today is Name That Tune Tuesday. The theme today is theme songs. All you need to do is guess which TV show each song is from. Homeroom teachers, get your emails ready and name that tune. for today's edition of Name That Tune Tuesday. Send in those emails, we will announce the winner at the end of the broadcast. And now for today's announcements. The next Natural Helpers meeting will be October 14th. Elections will be held. You must let Mr. Homer or Ms. Velez know if you are running before the meeting. All members should also give you cell phone numbers for the WhatsApp notifications. For all junior high students interested in creative writing, join Tapestry Club. They are meeting today in the Writing Center after school. If you have any questions, please speak to Ms. Kearns. Junior high mathletes will meet for the first time today in J7. All interested 7th, 8th, and 9th graders are welcome. All meets will be home, and please see Ms. Victorson if you have any questions. The next meeting for the SAD slash SWAT team is today. Elections will be held. Please send Mr. Homer if you want to run for office. Bring $10 if you want to buy a SWAT shirt. Students who wish to volunteer at the junior high back to school night need to sign up in the junior high office. The book club's next meeting will be in the public library on Wednesday, October 21st from 7 to 8.30. Karen and Flagon Brodesy, the author of Historic Haunts of Long Island, will be speaking and signing copies of her book. Sign up outside the English office if you plan to attend. Anyone interested in attending Saturday's speech contest at Sacred Heart Academy should sign up with Mrs. Glenn or Ms. Schmieder by Wednesday morning. Come practice your speech before or after school. The debate team will meet after school today in H3. And now for your Seahawks sports update. Attention students, homecoming is fast approaching, which means it's time for Spirit Week. This year we have lots of new activities planned, so stay tuned to Hawk Talk for the weekly updates. The first thing you need to know is that Spirit Week is starting this Friday with USA Day. Wear your patriotic prints, or red, white, and blue, and get the enthusiasm going. Next week is Pajama Day on Tuesday, Sports Jersey Day on Wednesday, Prep Day on Thursday, and Color Day on Friday. Look around the school for flyers for more information. And now for today's games. Today's away games are boy v, Boys JV Soccer at Locust Valley, Varsity Golf vs. Locust Valley, Golf vs. Roslyn, JV Field Hockey at Garden City, and Varsity Girls Tennis at Wheatley, both at 415. Varsity Girls Soccer, 7th grade Boys Soccer at Jericho, and 7th grade Soccer at Harris. <laughs> Today's home game, today game, home games are 8th grade Boys Soccer vs. Jericho, 8th grade Tennis vs. Henry, Varsity Field Hockey vs. Garden City, and JV Girls soccer at New High Park all at 4:30. Bo boys varsity soccer at Locust Valley at 7 p.m. Go Seahawks! See yeah. And now it's time to reveal the answers to today's Name That Tune Tuesday. The theme songs were Friends, Kari in the House, and Seinfeld. And the word today's Name That Tune Tuesday is Mr. Homer's first period class. Congratulations! And that's the Hawk Talk for today. I'm Dean Carfora. And I'm John McGowan. Have a great Have day, day Cold Spring, Spring Harbor. Harbor.